One day I'm gonna get to the point where I can just make my Instagram name just Jimmy. Just you know, Jimmy. take out that last name and just everybody knows Jimmy. You know, yeah. I don't need a last name. What about James? Or James, Jimmy James. Jimmy James. Jimmy James. Speaking of who am I, we got a little game. Okay. We want to know how well y'all know each other as group members. Oh, oh hey. okay. The game is called oh, hey. who, am I? Who, am I? Who, am who Am I? Who Am I? This is nice. <clears throat> so, it surprised us. The first question, yeah, it's got to be a surprise. It's okay. real authentic right here. Yeah. Now, we really get to, Let's go. We, Let's we get to it. We know one of the answers right here. We already know one of the answers. Come on, man. Favorite food is bananas? <laughs> no. For tapping into that. <laughs> <sighs> Jimmy, who Jimmy. is Noah's favorite artist? Oh, man. Does he know? I think he knows. Does he know? I think he knows. He knows. Um, so he's he's inspired by a lot of, um, I would say, production. You know, you, you kind of define, you know, uh, your words and, like, the way you, your, your verses, you kind of, articulate that on your own you know I, th I feel like you inspire yourself with words i feel like when it comes to production that's like where you go uh and listen um oh what's his name what's his name <laughs> is it uh but uh it starts with an a an a i think it's like bonobo but no bonobo is a b Bono oh <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Bonobo. Bonobo. Bonobo is my favorite artist. I knew that. Absolutely. No yeah. question. Starts with a B. Bonobo. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know who Bonobo is. Bonobo has been around for a minute. Mm -hmm. It's kind of crazy because, like, when I was younger and I was listening to him, he just was like, like, he would build off of loops and everything. And it was just like, you know, just music and, and just sounds, really. It's, there weren't no any words like that. And then, like, over time, he started, like, bringing in, like, other female artists. They would sing. And mm -hmm. it turned into like this whole neo soul thing, and now it's like electronic music. Um, everything is so intentional in his work and everything, and it's just like, like man, I I, I love that art. That that is a he's a pretty solid artist. Definitely okay, inspiration. Noah. Do you do you know my favorite artist? Yeah. Who yeah. am I? Jane, your favorite artist is that? Uh, well, I want to say two people. Okay. I want to say two people. First person I want to say is Kanye West. The second person I want to say is Kendrick Lamar. Mm. And they're both for different reasons. Because I know that your favorite rapper is Kendrick Lamar. I know yes. that for a fact. Yes. But I also know, like, style-wise, stylistically, ideas, you know what I mean? When it comes to, like, everything as a whole, you really admire Kanye West. Yeah. I know that for a fact. When Vultures mm -hmm. came out, you literally <laughs> texted me, did I listen to it yet? And I was like, nah, I haven't really had to. Before I even got done texting that back, you were like, you need to listen to it. It's <laughs> like you knew that I was saying no. You, you, and you called me. It's all about the energy. You didn't have the energy. Yeah. He, he called me that day, and I wasn't holding back. I had no filter. I just listened to Kanye. Like, I, I was yeah. going to be a little bit of a dickhead that day. You know, I had, to, I had yeah. to have no filter. You know, I remember calling a bunch of things out because <laughs> right. i wasn't holding back but yeah i would say production wise definitely uh yay with his sampling mm -hmm. um and genuinely personality and the person wise like kendrick uh, kendrick's like the the father i never had type shit right um you know i grew up with him uh for him it was like i started playing the drums when i was five and i always understood rhythm I always got a rhythm in my head. I have one in I my head. I want y'all to imagine a five-year-old Jimmy playing drums right now. Annoying as shit. <laughs> oh my God. Five years old, not knowing what he's doing. Just two, two, two drumsticks and yeah. a full drum set. My mom, she regretted buying me that set. <laughs> she wished she got me an electric. But she didn't. She got me that real. Um, but, uh, you know, that I heard Good Kid Mad City. Specifically Mad City. I heard that song and I'm like... Music has a story. It has more than just a sound. Like, you can do things mm -hmm. with your voice and your words and put you somewhere. Like, bro put me in Compton that day. You mm -hmm. know, I realized you it could do that. So, from that point on, I realized every, it's it, rapping is like a vocal percussion. Everything I'm doing with my hands, I could do with my voice and tell stories and write poems and, you know, make music out of it. So, that was like Kendrick for me is like, you know, that's my... 
That's my heart right there. Shouts out to Kendrick. I'm sure he gets shouts out a no lot. No world. Facts, facts, facts. Who is in Soul's favorite artist? Mm. Oh, that's a good question because her her music catalog is really deep. <laughs> She's really all over the place with her music. Yeah. Uh. Damn, that's a tough one right there. Uh, um. <laughs> all right, who's uh? <clears throat> That's rough. I'll, I'll kind of make it a little easy. Um, is it Kay Trinata? Producer. Kay Trinata is somebody. That's, that's your favorite it's, fa- it's a favorite, yeah. Okay. But, but not like number one. Producer. <sighs> engineer. They're a producer, engineer? Nah, I really don't know. Now you gotta tell me. Flying <sighs> Lotus. Flying, I was going to say Lotus? that. Flying Lotus. I knew yes. it. Flying Lotus. But you, yes. I know you listen to Flying Lotus. Give that, I know yeah. you, listen, you listen to Kate Trinata more when I'm there. Oh, now I got to go listen to some. <laughs> okay. Kate Trinata do dope, though, for sure. Favorite. Flying Lotus. I just got so many, like, I listen to so, so much different music, man, like. And it's really my mom. Shout out my mom. Shout out to mom. Shout out to shout moms. Out, shout out Laura. I got sure. one. Your Miss, Miss Laura. You call your mom Laura? No. What's up, Laura? Hey, don't call my mom. You just called your mom? I, I ain't like the, the, <laughs> the, the, the energy. You know, I never met your mom. You, yeah, it was kind of spicy. Yeah, was, you was yeah, spicy was, with that. I never met her mom. <laughs> you know, what's up, Laura? What's up, Laura? How you doing? That was more inquisitive than just, what's good, than just you know. That wasn't <laughs> friendly. <laughs> you know, but yeah, man, she like, she gave birth she, to this amazing person right here. What's up with you? you know what I, mean? <laughs> I just want to talk to her. Just like, see how she doing. Yeah. The plot like, thickens. Hit <laughs> yeah. Like, hit her up sometimes. Like, you know, like, what's going on? Miss Laura. He said we're getting deep. Mm-hmm. Yes, getting <laughs> deep. Hey, man. Hey, chills. Hey. Chills. Moms are off limits. Jimmy, how's your mom doing? My mom? Your mom? Yeah, your mom? Well, I feel like Shannon Sharp right now. Why y'all doing this? <laughs> Why y'all making me nervous? What's happening? <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> uh, if you're listening, I hope you're doing great. No, I didn't I mean love anything. You. Hey, Jimmy's mom. Uh, and your What's mom know what's up. My mom was dope. My mom does send Jimmy a whole plate of food. Moms are dope. I'm I'm a mom. Yeah. Yep. She's Shout a mom. Out to being a mom. Dope Moms mom. are dope. Uh, Noah's mom, she made me the most amazing cheesy spaghetti the other day. She didn't really make you the <laughs> Don't say it like she made it for you. She made it in general and then she gave you some. Like she, she was thinking of me <laughs> when she delivered it to me. She didn't deliver. She I gave was it to me. I was thinking about it when she had you deliver I ain't it to none. me. You didn't get none? No. No. Sorry. Damn. So. Damn, that is deep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, damn. But she, she she only met you like one time. And like, it was like really quick. Like oh, yeah. she met Jimmy like twice, three times already. Oh, yeah. I'm going to pull through on your mom and say, hey, what, what's up? What's Why your you mom say Y'all put like sugar that? in y'all spaghetti? <laughs> <laughs> Miss Banks, spaghetti? yeah, Miss Banks to you. Hey, Miss oh. Banks. <laughs> you don't put sugar in your spaghetti. <laughs> Who puts sugar in spaghetti? Yes, my yes, you. Thank you. you. Do that as a thing. You yeah. put. Yeah. My, my mom makes spaghetti with that? like. Elf. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> she puts. My mom puts brown sugar. If I'm not mistaken, brown sugar in spaghetti. That's mm. not. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're not putting like Kool Aid sugar. Like just. Uh, it helps with. <laughs> Just, just a little. She puts like just brown a sugar. Salt bay, you know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> a little bit of a uh, sweet baby rays. Yeah. No, it helps rays. with the. Uh, yeah. It's like so that good. Acidic. See, that's that's good. baking you know soda. Good. I put baking yeah. soda in mm-hmm. the in the in the tomato sauce. It makes it. It's like a little sweet, to kind of get rid of the like, acidity. It like a, like a, I might try that. Yes. Mm, like a hug. Hey man. <laughs> Shout out to spaghetti. As long as it's got a nice hefty bag of cheese on it. Yep. In the a, whole bag? The whole bag. Whole bag. Of cheese? Whole bag. Whole bag. Spaghetti? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got it. Parmesan oh, or like... It's got to have the pool. That's yeah, a lot of cheese. We can do though, sharp cheddar. Yeah. I, I mean, feel judged. If you're making no, it... No, I ain't judging. Like a pan. Yeah. Like a pan. Like a pan. Like a pan. Yeah, I got to have Parmesan. Oh, yeah. Some sharp cheddar. I need to try. And some hot sauce. Just... Oh, yeah. What kind of hot sauce are we talking? Cholula? Texas Pete, man. Texas Pete. Never heard of Texas Pete. Never Do y'all not like Texas Pete out here in Chicago? Mm-hmm. It's not a thing. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Mind blown. No, but we we willing to try it though. We not against Texas Pete. We're not against no, rap. No. <laughs> We're not against, We're not rap. against rappers. No. no, but everybody I talk to out here got Louisiana. I'm like. Yeah, that's because the, Louisiana be popping. Louisiana definitely. I, I, I do that. Chalulu. You throwing on some Popeyes like. 
Right. It's the Cholulu uh, green pepper. Or some green, some kind of see, oh, see, This some, is how it goes yeah, every pepper. time. On some real shit, though. We're going to be at the arcade by 7 o'clock. <laughs> Shouts out to avocados. Are we hitting the arcade? That, avocados. Avocados are my, one of my favorite things. She she liked that. She raised her hand and everything. Like, avocados right. from Mexico? <laughs> avocados from Mexico. I make my own guacamole. And mm. y'all want to know the secret. I chop up some Granny Smith apples and I put it in my avocado. But I can't put sugar in my damn. Skin. It gives it. Li- <laughs> mm. I never said you couldn't. You put apples. I was just confuzzled. <laughs> you throwing some apples in? I lost in you. In your guac. It gives right. it a little sour. Are I you like dicing these apples or? Oh uh, yeah, how you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Jimmy, what are you, are you doing? Are you, cutting them? Them? Are you okay. dicing them? I learned from the most real. My my homie Jose from Oaxaca. I like he how told he said me. that. I like how he said that. Oaxaca. Shit. The most real, not just. <laughs> The realest. No, the most real. The most. Homie Jose, straight from Oaxaca. Shouts out to Jose. Shout out to Jose. Uh, he, you're, you're the most real. Bro. Most real. He most real. taught me how to make guac and, you know, it life changing. Hey, so we're going to have Smith. Jimmy back on an episode one day and we're going to make guac. We're making guac. I'm already mm. cooking, with Jim. cooking with Jimmy. Cooking with Jimmy. And I'm going to bring some infused butter. Yes. Oh, yeah. Can, mm. I, can I just come? I want to I I wanna watch that. Yeah, I, wanna, like, I like to partake. Yeah, be the judge. Yeah. I'll let you try it. Yeah, we'll have a cook off. I don't, really like, I don't like guacamole. guacamole like that. I don't like guacamole like that. And we're all going to go home very, very high. I don't know what it is. Way. I think it's a, consi- <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a consistency thing. I don't know. Good or bad. It's creamy. Not, it's not creamy. It's just it's creamy. Stop texting me, damn it. It's like the creamiest <laughs> vegetable you can think of. It's unprofessional. Gosh. Or is it a fruit? I don't know. All right. To the group. You're putting together a festival. <clears throat> We're not talking about that event yet. Well, hold on. You're putting together an outdoor Coachella science festival. Right. Mainstream or underground? Name your card. Who's on the card? It's your festival. Uh, well, we gotta have yay. Gotta have yay. We gotta have yay <laughs> in the door. He's a, you don't know if he'll show up or not. I wasn't gonna say it. Gotta invite him. Let's stick to the wise. Yeet just dropped. Shout out Yeet. Shout out to Yeet. I'm not gonna lie. Get busy. I I wasn't a big fan of Yeet before because I felt like I just couldn't connect with his music like that on an emotional level. But like the newest album did feel like bigger. It, it was felt, hard. Yeah, it was it was new. Like I, I felt like everything was like on a different on a different level. Yeah. I, want, I, I, I really want that house it. he shot uh, Get Busy in. That fucking beautiful mm. ass glass house. Yeah. <laughs> I would never throw stones. Uh so we got Yeet Ye. Yeet Ye. Mm. I would say uh, Tyler, the creator. Mm. Very uh, necessary. He, I, I've seen him live twice now, both times in Vegas. Yeah, and Vegas. he he always has a different set. Mm. He, mm. he never has the same <laughs> set about to go. once. Yeah. And it's crazy. Yeah, I forgot the words okay. for a second. Okay, 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 uh, okay, okay, mm. okay, okay. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I definitely... That I part. definitely would have to say I would want to have Thundercat. Ooh, Ooh Thundercat yes. Sure. yes. 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 Thundercat. Yes. Like, yes. And amazing on, on the bass, but man, he can mm. sing, like, straight up. Like, you know, y'all can't forget, right? What is one of the, y'all can't forget. Y'all can't forget <laughs> one of the biggest artists out here from Chicago. Oh shit! Forever Infinite. We gotta have Forever Infinite ah, on the card. I mean, y'all, 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 y'all better Infinite. be on the card. <laughs> we gotta be on the card. Yeah, that part. Y'all gotta that be part. on the card. It's y'all show. Yeah, that part. Yeah. yeah, let's do y'all, that. Yeah. I I had an idea for how I would come on the stage for that festival. Don't do what it. What do you mean by come on? Don't the do stage? it. No, I don't think you should do that. How I would approach it. I don't think you should do that. Quite like like do you, in front of everybody. Would you like to hear it? They're canceling people now for that. Um. Oh. So, <laughs> I, the way I would want to do my yeah, show. Maybe, um, the way the way I want to do my show and nobody steal my idea, right? It's this all is, yours. This has been brewing in my brain. I know what he's about to say. I'm, yep, you know. I, I know too. It. Rebirth. Oh my right. god. Right. <laughs> um, <laughs> I want I want like two large uh, female legs to open up from the top of the stage, <sighs> and I like, drop down in a diaper. It. It's like the third time I've heard this. It is never genius. He keeps saying funny. it. It's happening. <laughs> he always I'm dropping wait. down. Granted, I'll be bald and I'm having I have a diaper. Uh, <laughs> right, right. <laughs> Dropping down and I'm on this oh like this God. cord representing the umbilical, and I drop down, cut the cord, and boom, 
legs closed, I'm on stage. I just got rebirthed. Hey, Jimmy, I think that like you should keep the cord. Hey. For the Jimmy, mic. cord on. Yes, Jimmy, the cord the this from the, straight from the source. Out of nowhere, straight from the source. Yeah. Like he will be yeah. just like, you know what would be really cool. You know what I should do? And it's so I can't wait it. to do it. I'm so proud. I'm gonna be born on stage one day. I'm gonna. And, mm. and, and and I'm gonna have a clothes rack on the side. I was actually inspired by little baby because I saw him live and he did this. Um, he basically changed his fit every song. He had a clothes rack, and he had some like ladies that go and like dress him up in front of everyone. It was dope. So like I'm gonna start with a diaper, and then I'm gonna have full blown layers on. Shout out Not to layers. Diaper. Shout out to the layers. <laughs> y'all gonna put respect layers. on it one day. A diaper. And, and, and me and Jimmy. When, when y'all start wearing double hoodies right. and you start coming on stage as b- fucking babies? Right. Right here. Yeah. Layers. <laughs> That's, this is where it Why began. are those the only two options? This is where it began. <laughs> Why are those? The- because because <laughs> it's, it you gotta wear people two going. Hoodies? Right? It's provocative. It, it's provocative. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful big titty, but naked women just don't follow this guy, you know? That's, uh... Beautiful. Oh, I was, I mean, you know, titty, but naked but women just don't fall out the sky, sky, you know. The sky, you know. The sky, you know. Uh, sky, you know. My, my favorite track is Paid. Because they're so valuable. I love Paid because it's just, it's, uh, what does he say? Friday night, let's all get paid. Friday <laughs> night, let's all get paid. And it's like this house and it, house music. It's just, it's a jam because it's yeah. like I just started getting paid on Fridays. This is my anthem now. Every I Friday. I'm on my way yes. to this interview. Every let's Friday. Go. See, my Everybody pay anthem is, uh, first of the month. That used to first. be my anthem. Yeah. 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 Yes, sir. Shout out to capitalism. <laughs> yeah. Book capitalism. Okay. Um, Tell me we said what Because we love capitalism. Um, we're going to, yeah, because we're going to all be rich one day. Right. Doing mm-hmm. this rap shit. Is that the goal? And making infused guacamole. To be rich. Financial infused freedom. Infused guacamole. And financial freedom burrito. is not freedom. It's not. I don't even know why I said that, but. Why is not free? We're here. <laughs> because because Wait, your freedom, what? anytime where your freedom is tied to something, that's not being free. No, it's it's got it's got stipulations with it. Exactly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So. True freedom is one in which like you don't need or you're not dependent on anything to be happy. Like like a true. monk? Monks have true happiness. Okay. I would say I would say homeless people are probably the, the truest, freest people in the world. But are they happy? And they keep getting locked up Mm. just for being homeless, which is really crazy. But are they happy? Some of them are very happy. (laughs) Some of them are very happy. I'm talking about peace. Yeah. When you are Mm -hmm. homeless, oh, my God. Don't be homeless and still got some money coming in. Peace. You are just, you're not tied to a house or a car. And you're just able to fix yourself. That's the true thing. Like, if you really think about it, the the idea of means like, you know. Now, don't get me wrong. I I personally, I, I want a house one day because I want mm-hmm. a family. Yeah, we don't want to be homeless forever. I, I I personally would not want to be homeless. That's just I'm not about that life. You know what I mean? I'm I'm accustomed to this to this world. But you know, um, if we think about it, like the things that we think that we need, you know, it's crazy. You know, they they shared this video of what's the name Orlando Brown saying. You're making us pay for grapes. You're making us pay for apples. <laughs> You're making us pay for apples. <laughs> I saw God that, and it, it was crazy. The way he said it is hilarious. He was mad, man. But if you think about it, like the Earth really does supply everything that we need, and we go and we just created things and to said, do the work "You for guys us. need this too." Yeah. You got to do the and work. And over the course of, of 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 years in life, we have it in our head. You know what? I I definitely need a. TV, you know what I mean. I definitely need a PS Five, you know. No, I you you do need. actually. <laughs> you need a PS Five. I don't have a PS Five. <laughs> Me neither. I don't have a PS Five, <laughs> but, but I, I, I have a TV one. though. I definitely have a TV. Yeah. But imagine if you never had that. If you never experienced that in life, like what if, like, you know, what you felt like you needed was like to be happy. What you felt like you needed in life was to experience life. Like to experience nature, mm. you need you considerably I mean? much mm-hmm. less than what the world tells you today. <laughs> For real, absolutely. Yeah. For real. Like, and with, with social media is a thing now. You just sit there and you look at somebody's life and you think, "Oh, I'm not yeah. adding up to it." Like, yeah, that exactly. comparison. You yeah. I do that all the time. Too. I do that all the time. And it's, like, it's, man. it's not right because half of those guys aren't really that. Those are Airbnbs, rental cars, somebody else's house that they hey, can I use this for a video. Yeah. yeah, you know. 
the other half of those guys aren't happy. No. Facts. Like, look at, I don't want to say the guy's name, but there's a streamer that's been getting disrespected on his live mm. constantly by these rappers. Mm. And I can imagine, like, at a, at a point, it hurts you. Like, I've reached this success, but now I can't trust anybody around me. Mm. Mm-hmm. So what's it worth? To back y'all up, they did do a neurological study on a monk, um, and it was the happiest brain they've ever found. Mm -hmm. The happiest brain they ever found. You know, he unlocked all his chakras. He is one, and it's like the little things that made him happy. It's like a little dandelion blowing in the wind. That's his happiness for the day. That's beautiful to me. Yeah. Even Andre said, like, you know, being famous is not normal. Oh, like, Andre 2000. Oh, my yeah. God. You recently said that. Andre is yes. another favorite for sure. <sighs> S- specifically, Did y'all Andre. y'all like his flute album? <laughs> no. Bro, because then y'all not real Andre 2000 fans. You, you, you said that, that We wanted all. him to rap. He only had no, one job. No, 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 no. You oh. wanted him to rap. You I wanted one music. job. I wanted Andre music I could breathe himself. with. And I what? felt it. I wanted him to rap. He was he was I wanted doing him, him to. I didn't even listen to the flute album. I love it. What? what? The Bro. first song is like I really wanted to make a rap album. You get you a backwood. But he did what he wanted. And you put but what I, you want in there. Yeah. Man, that was the most peaceful. Thank Forty-five you. minute hour. I, I was not at peace. He was breathing like he you could, was man, it was, and it was different. The key and peel sketch was so true. <laughs> if I would have had shrooms, I would. Please, man. If, the I'm, like, I'm not gonna so lie, chill. you know, because so he funny. literally said, "I'm gonna take, some, I got some metal, and I'm gonna rub it together, and make some metal screeching sounds. That's gonna be the whole next album." <laughs> and then, like ten years later, he did it. The P and Q was good. How is that different from those those weird drummers in Czechoslovakia that just beat the hell out of tables in, in a snare drum? Because they're not they're from Czechoslovakia. They can do that, but Andre 3000 is is not Czechoslovakian. Mm. He is. Are we sure? You can't, you can't, you can't box him in, man. You can't box Andre. You got to check the lineage. All right. Check the lineage. Is Be- what I'm before we get out of here, um, and just Ryan, we're going to queue up. We're not done yet. Well, let's queue up Who Am I for the end of the show. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Um, before, while we get ready for this performance. Y'all ready for this performance? Y'all ready? Y'all locked let's in. Let's go. He's, yeah, yeah. What's happening February twenty fourth? February twenty fourth, we've got we've got music, we've got fashion, we've got food, food. We've mm-hmm. got uh, I've art. got dancers, I've got comedians, art, I got art, us art. Uh, art. It's an art mm-hmm. show, fashion show, showcase. One of the biggest combination of different mo- medias. You know what I mean? In one setting, you know, we got two floors of amazing, amazing talent. Um, it's also our first show as a group coming together. Um, probably, probably one of the most amazing shows you've ever been to. Yeah, honestly, mm-hmm. you know what I mean. It's an experience. Experience. A true experience. Mm-hmm. Uh, you all are invited. Please yes, come, come through. Please. Slide. Please. Yes. It's in, uh, Pilsen Please. at a spot called Healthy Hood. Shout out to Healthy Hood. Um, yeah. They definitely. Uh, Definitely represent culture. It's called the Culture Forever Gala. Because, yeah. you know, I realized something. We're, we're an amazing group, right? We make good music. But how you impact culture, you have to do more than just make music. You have to impact art. You have to impact, like, fashion. You have to... It's comedy. It's in everything. You know what I mean? So, I went out and I, I, I got all of that together. and uh, Connector. So, <laughs> yeah, connector. Yeah. Connector. Connector. Yeah, and, and uh, the amazing art. show. <clears throat> show. So who who's on the card? Who we got? We got Forever Infinite. Who else? We got Forever Infinite. We've got Hit Zion. We've got Can't Buy Deem. Can't got, Buy Deem's can't, going can't to be Deem in the building. Sure. We hey. got Gilly Neve uh, and what? Big Bands. We got who? You Gil just Gil swiped right over that name. We got Gil in the building Gil showing us on the 24th, and he is popping Thanks. off. He's got Gil set. I'm going to have a clean set, I promise. Clean set. Clean set, yeah. for the most part. For the most part. I, It'll be... I will s- For everybody. It's gonna be yep. a healthy hood. Healthy hood. I will say I've I've put together a lot of sets. I like to uh, arrange, you know, sets and give people a, a spectacle. Um, but the vision and what I'm creating for uh, next weekend, the 24th, is the biggest thing I've ever done. Uh, That's right. Huge. That's so right. Can't uh, wait. We cover all all 
types of energy you know it's truthfully like a story it's not it's not all up like we're gonna let y'all chill and think about what we have to say you know That's we're right. gonna go hard and you know give y'all some of the hardest shit you've ever heard i damn jimmy i, I swear to god I was I was, why did you say it like i was that? gonna let you slide no i, I am i'm <laughs> I gonna slide said, the first part was like acceptable but the second one was just like just just know it's, it's gonna be lit <laughs> it's hard come through <laughs> it's gonna be lit <laughs> gonna be lit the menu <laughs> the menu's crazy let's talk about that menu i don't even know yes i don't, don't understand it. it's, it's i don't know how to pronounce half the i don't things. how right. i know it's when fancy because you know I, I like i like i don't know what's what it chickpeas. is are there chickpeas there's like there's a bunch of words on there that i don't understand it was so a, i'm like yes you know it's good when it was in cursive and it was in cursive it was in cursive the menu was in cursive i think i saw couscous Couscous. I don't know what yeah, that is. No couscous. idea. It's very good. You don't good. know what couscous is? Is that hummus or something? No. It's kind of like rice. Hummus? What? Yeah. Rice? Hummus? No. Uh, yeah, you get some. We got rib sliders. Yeah. Rib, mm. rib sliders. We got that. That's. What, I'm excited about yeah, that. Cook, I don't know about the other um, stuff. Who's, who's yeah. the cook? Uh, Salad. Really? We got some lettuce. I don't want that shit. I want the rib sliders. <laughs> I want the rib sliders. <laughs> I don't know what everything else is. Shout out the other uh, I the saw chef. rib sliders and got Shout so excited. Shout out to Emilio. Emilio. Shout out Emilio. Emilio. Yeah. Emilio. He's a sous chef. Ooh. Works in a restaurant. You know, um, this is like purpose manifested, man. Dead ass. When you see your purpose manifested, yeah, they gonna respect. It's I mean gonna that. be. Hey, and and is there a dress code for the people? You gotta dress up. Form yeah. dress nice. You know, I'm wearing a suit for most of the night mm-hmm. uh, until we perform. Um. I'm not telling everybody to wear a suit, but you know, just come nice. You come know what I mean? Fashionable. There'll be photographers there. Uh, interviews will be going on. Uh, yeah. Really dope. We're going live. We're going live. It'll be dope opportunities for everybody to to really represent their brand, mm-hmm. represent themselves. Just yeah. look nice, man. Just High fashion. Working, this is this is this is it. And is there a cost for the people? It's a it's a, it's a cost. You know, it's just like thirty five dollars. You know what I mean? Thirty five dollars. Thirty five dollars. Thirty five dollars for so you, food, art. You can't Music. afford to give me $35? All, it, all it comes, it's all <laughs> yeah. together. Perfect date night, too. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? If you want somewhere to go to yeah. actually eat and have a good time and have a full experience, it's definitely one of those yep, things. And, and none safe, of the performers you know are like Usher. You will go home with your date. That's right. Yes. We'll, we nobody will take you. your date. No. As far as I know. We promise you. It's yeah. a respectful event. Yes. So. I don't no. know. I'm lying. I don't know. You never know. You never know. You never know. <laughs> she might like my cologne or something. I don't know. That's right. <laughs> it's, it's Versace. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> mm. <laughs> he said, wear your Sunday best, essentially. Wear your Sunday best, man. And, best. Yes. man. Y'all gonna enjoy yourself. Are y'all coming? Y'all better come. Y'all yeah. Y'all yeah. Come through. Yeah. Slide, yeah. man. It's gonna yeah, be it's nice. Gonna it's gonna be, gonna be nice. Gonna be nice. Yep. Ryan's coming, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shout yeah. out to Ryan. Miss, I, miss, could, I could set y'all up a spot. You know what I mean? Y'all could, like, go live or something like that. You know what I mean? Represent y'all brand. Facts. I'll even give one of y'all a, a, a talking what's your name, too, so that y'all can, like, introduce somebody but represent BB. You know what I mean? TV. Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah. Appreciate that, bro. And appreciate then introduce somebody to the stage type shit. So. Coming to the stage. That'd be lit. That'll yeah. be yeah. lit. Y'all are great. Okay. Y'all are great, man. We really appreciate y'all. We got to give back to each other. Amen. That's how we do it. BBE mm-hmm. forever. Oh, we're doing this for charity too. Shout out to the Core Music Foundation. Yep. So it's for a good uh, cause. For a good cause. Definitely. That's why y'all got to pay that thirty five dollars. Yes. That's also why you got to pay that. Like, like, because we care. We out here we doing it for the people, man. <laughs> and it's gonna be a good, positive experience. It's a, it's a different look than what y'all would know from the culture. And yeah. I, I'm so excited. I'm so. I know I was. I, I keep like, yo, no. How long is my set? What do you want me to do? I want to, yeah. yo. I'm trying to make sure everything good because it's gonna be a dope experience, man. I'm excited for y'all. We, Let's go. we've like known each other from a year to like in Seoul, probably like three, four months, and I feel like I've known y'all forever. Y'all talented people, man. Beautiful people. Thank you. Wish the best nice. to y'all going forward. This is gonna be a crazy week, a crazy fun week. Yes. Let's go. Let's get fun. it. Yeah. When we come back, y'all, we're gonna do something different. Y'all used to seeing them right here. We're gonna do a booth performance, and it's gonna be dope. It's gonna be dope. I already know it's gonna be dope. I already know the song. Y'all don't. <laughs> yeah. He knows it. Yeah. It's the Yo, perks. He knows it. He knows it. He knows it's it. the perks. Yeah. Of being with BBE and mm-hmm. being cool with Forever Infinite. Like, Forever like Infinite. it's like mm-hmm. that. It's like that. One of the newest, hottest groups coming out of Chicago. Yep. Hey, when that video dropping? 
You doing that video? I just got the video last night. Say word. I just got the video last night. Coming so soon. Coming soon. Coming soon. Sure. Want to drop snippets? Yes. Yeah. Drop, start off with snippets. Yeah. You know. I could get into that video. It was so cold. It was colder that day than it is today. And that's crazy. Yeah. That is true. <laughs> it was pretty cold. That it was day. painfully it's a cold. Music video. Sacrifices it was a dope location, though. It was sure. so dope. I'm so ready to see it. I'm so, oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, it was lit. It was lit. So, when we get back, Forever Infinite, in the booth, live performance. Peace. Peace. Hey. Yeah. 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 Peace. We did that thing. That was the longest interview. It was long? It was about an hour. We must pay homage to him. Hey, yo, show, hey, yo, Jimmy, where y'all at? Who am I? Hey, this for the... Who am I?